Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Teresa Ellen Arianis, TEA, and this is Tea Time Adventures on YouTube. What's in the bag, sweetheart? It is my very first Ice Cream Beauty bag. Not the box, but the bag. Why? Because I'm not a makeup channel. I don't do get ready with me's. I'm not a palette girl, but I did want to try something new and different. Push the envelope, get out of my comfort zone a little bit, and I wanted to see what they had to offer, but I didn't want to commit to a whole big box. So I got the bag instead. Now it's $12.50, $4 for shipping and a dollar for tax. So it comes for me a grand total of $16.50 a month. So I've already ripped open the side so we don't have to hear that rip. And let's see what we've got. Now I guess you can get anywhere from three to five items. Ice Cream Beauty Bag from March. Trend Beauty. Gimme More Palette, which is worth $12, which is the price of the bag, basically. Then we have a Mirabella Sealed with a Kiss Lipstick. And that is a value of $22. And then we have Mirabella Beauty Pro Sculpt Clear Brow Gel, worth $18. Now I know right off the bat, I am not gonna do this. I am a natural brow girl. Um, occasionally I'll pluck a stray long hair, uh, but I don't do anything with them. I don't color them, I don't wax them, I don't pluck them. These are just my natural eyebrows. So I definitely know I will not be using this. I am kind of curious as to what it looks like. It, very pretty packaging, a very um, bright red. I think there's some little bit of orange overtones to that red. And that's what it looks like on the outside. Just a little silver bullet of a, of a clear brow gel. So there is that. Then we've got the Mirabella lipstick in sugar and spice. It's always easier to open it up from the bottom, I think. Let's see. I don't want to rip the packaging. Just got to be careful with it. So again, very pretty packaging with that ombre effect. Kiss. There's a kiss right there. Elegant packaging. Golden white. And again, this is called sugar and spice. It is rather dark. I could still use it. I tend towards lip stains more, but sorry, I have to smell it. No scent, which is good, because some lipsticks have this weird scent, but it's very pretty, very pretty. I'm not going to squatch it, though. No, 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 no. Just because I'm not sure if I'm keeping it or not, um, I guess I could get away with it. I don't generally wear lipsticks like this. I wear lip stains that last 24 hours and you have to basically scrub them off hard. So the last thing in here was Trend Beauty Gimme More palette. Definitely the trend of the cassette tape of the 80s that I grew up with. Um, it has uh, the colors sort of on the back, so it does look like it is blues. Again, let's see. Now it does have a mirror, so I'm going to cover that up. Ooh, this is definitely a color story that I can get into. Look at that entire bottom row. Oh my heavens, that color alone right there. And then we've got another shimmer here and here, and then the rest are mattes. So to me, there's way too many mattes. So six, seven, eight, nine, ten mattes out of 18. Um, so six, seven, eight shimmers. But, um, you know, the colors themselves are all usable. I really don't know how to blend shadows. That's just one super shock shadow. So I don't have to worry about blending. <laughs> But this is definitely a keeper for me. I definitely want to learn how to play around with it because this color story itself is absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> it's very cute packaging. Definitely reminds me of the cassette tapes of the 80s when I was in high school. So it's very retro. Very, very retro. 
Um, so that is it. I'm not going to swatch anything. I uh, will probably give the brow gel away to somebody else. I'm not sure about the lipstick yet. We'll have to wait and see. But that is what is in the Ice Cream Beauty bag. Is it worth it? Just the palette alone is worth the $12 um, for the, the bag. Um, and then the rest is gravy. Is it worth uh, $16.50? These three items, definitely, you're getting your values worth with it. Now, again, I am not a palette girl. I am not a makeup channel. I don't do get ready with me's. So that's just not my thing. But again, I wanted to try something new and different. I want to push the envelope a little bit. I want to do stuff that brings me joy. So thought I'd try something new. So thank you for coming along with me today on my little makeup journey. <laughs> yeah, we cut the bangs too short. I was using a, a Timu bang thing and yeah, it would have been great if it stayed there because my bangs were wet and then when they dried they went up there so eh, they'll grow back in a month or two no big deal but at least you can see my eyes and my expressive eyebrows <laughs> anyway thank you so much everybody please take good care of yourselves take good care of each other and i will see you around the net bye